Hello viewers, welcome to Ecomise Academy. Today we are here to discuss about Climate Risk Index 2025. Who releases this particular index? What is India's rank in this index? And what are the criteria used in this particular ranking? And what are the worst suffered or worst affected countries with respect to climate change? What are the main climatic phenomena that are impacting the world? And what is the performance across the countries? We'll understand in this particular video. Let us see the context. The Climate Risk Index 2025 was released recently, which has highlighted there is increase in the extreme events happening in terms of climate change. So that means increasing in the intensity of extreme events is what the observation of this particular index. Now let us understand what are the countries that were top in climate risk. First is Dominica. Dominica Republic is the country which has the high, most important or you can say most affected country and then is China then is Honduras right and if you see India is also among the top 10 countries you can see here on the board top 10 countries which were affected worldwide by the climate change related things then first let us understand what is this mainly this is based on the extreme events so how the climatic events extreme climatic events are going to impact the countries and the communities right that is the main thing that means it is going to assess the economic and human loss in terms of property infrastructure at the same time deaths and other things so how it is going to cause economic and human loss then who is going to publish this german watch so very important organization so they are going to publish this and they started publishing this index since 2006 onwards right now here there is an important announcement for those who are trying to prepare for UPSC 2025. So you know in UPSC prelims the most important stage is the preparation. And in preparation to have very much confidence you need to have proper revision. And if you are not having that proper revision in mind or if you are not able to implement your schedule which was planned, you can join us on this intensive revision program which was scheduled from 17th March 2025. In this particular program, the classes will be taken by subject experts where they will be detailing you the static parts as well as the current affairs linking and how to answer in a better way. So this will definitely boost your confidence in the upcoming prelims. So if you want the detailed schedule, you can scan on this particular QR code. At the same time, the program is available at a cost of 2999 only and those who enroll in this program can also avail our test series at the rate of triple nine rupees only so without any further delay you can contact us to know about more details and enroll in the course to boost your preparation then right then what is the aim of cra or climate risk index the main thing is to see how the global climate extreme events are happening climatic extreme events are happening at the same time what type of mitigation efforts we are taking so climatic risk related impacts will understand and then how to mitigate that particular thing at the same time will also draw a comparative analysis comparative analysis in the sense how different countries are performing or which country is the worst sufferer and who have the minimal impact what are the strategies they're deploying these type of things can be better understood using this particular index then what is the criteria for ranking so these are the criteria which are used in the ranking first one fatalities that means deaths how many deaths have occurred due to extreme climatic events is the first thing the same time affected population so how is the affected population that means we'll understand whether that is more among the old old persons or aged persons or is it the, the children or is it the women or the poor in that way demographic wise we are trying to understand who is more vulnerable to this particular climate change related things at the same time we will also understand economic losses in terms of infrastructure property and many other things so how much is economic loss to the gdp then number of extreme events if you will see over a period of time extreme events are increasing over a period of time so number of extreme events happened over a period of time will also be calculated and based on that we'll have have the ranking then long-term impact assessment so this was calculated between the time 1993 to 2022 so over this period of 20 years almost uh, you can say 30 years they have assessed that on a long-term basis the same time when you see the short-term impact they have calculated it only for the year 2022 alone right then if you see what is the highlight of the report, most affected countries are Dominican Republic, China and Honduras. So these are the top three countries. And if you see India, Myanmar, Italy and 
one or two. So these countries are also listed among the top 10 countries who got affected by the climate change. Then worst affected countries in 2022 alone. So this if you see this is for a time period of 1993 and 2022 long term basis. But if you see in short term in one particular year, Pakistan, Belize and Italy. So these are the top three countries or worst affected countries in terms of climate change. And what are mainly contributing to the climate related extreme events is heat even heat waves you can say storms and floods so these are mainly contributing to the extreme events in terms of climate change then if you see top disasters cyclones and storms are mainly contributing 35 percent at the same time heat waves if you see 30 percent of the damage is being caused at the same time floods are contributing by 27 percent in terms of extreme events then what is india's performance here if you see in long term ranking india is now ranked in sixth position India is ranked in sixth position. That means between a period of 1993 to 2022, India was ranked in sixth position in terms of extreme climatic events. And how many events happened in this period? Almost 400 plus extreme events happened in 30 years in India. At the same time, if you see, almost 80,000 plus persons have died due to extreme events and there is a loss of $180 billion in India over this period. And when you see the short term ranking, only in 2022, if you see, India has ranked 49th in that particular year. In the previous ranking, which was released in 2019, India was ranked in 7th position. Then severe floods, cyclones and heat waves have impacted us. That means in India in 2022. These are the reasons for extreme events in 2022 in India. Now let us see a practice question in this regard. According to the Climate Risk Index 2022, which country ranked as the most affected extreme weather events between 1993 to 2022? Which is the most impacted country? Let me know in the comment section. Then, which of the following extreme weather events are considered in the Climate Risk Index? Out of this, which is considered as one of the criteria for ranking? Let me know in the comment section. Then, today we have discussed about Climate Risk Index 2025, which was released by German Watch recently. We have seen what is the performance of different countries, top 10 countries, what is India's performance also, whether we have improved or we have drop down in the position At the same time we have seen what are the criteria and how climate change is increasing the intensity of extreme events in this particular video if you like the video do let us know in the comment section thanks for joining all the very best